no hope. And Kratos cast himself from the highest mountain in all of Greece. After ten years of suffering, ten years of endless nightmares, it would finally come to an end. Death would be his escape from madness. But it had not always been this way. Kratos had once been a champion of the gods. Oh, beast! I will send you back to the depths of Hades! They were real! The gods came to me, told me their champion would come and rescue us from the Hydra. But you're too late! We're pinned down! Oh, these creatures, they came from nowhere. The ships are all destroyed, all hope is lost, Spartan, even for you... Before you reach Athens, 
there is a task you must complete. This beast, this Hydra, it has terrorized my seas for far too long. Your skills are admirable, but you will need assistance. You will need the power of the gods. Take this weapon, Kratos. Take this power and use it to defeat your enemies. Go with the gods, Kratos. Go forth in the name of Olympus. That! That! Get them away from the ship! Why won't they die? It's the giant one! He keeps healing the others! No, I... God! We'll never get out of here! Doomed! We're doomed! We're all...
slaughtered like animals, the victims lay before him, a reminder of his own past, a past he could never escape. His only solace was the sea, endlessly sailing from one harbor to the next in service to the gods of Olympus. All his hopes rested with them. For no matter how much wine he consumed or how many women he took to his bed, nothing on earth could rid him of the horrors that plagued his mind. Athena! Ten years, Athena. I have faithfully served the gods for ten years. When will you relieve me of these nightmares? We request one final task of you, Kratos. Your greatest challenge awaits in Athens, where even now my brother Ares lays siege as we speak. Athens is on the verge of destruction. It is the will of Ares, my great city fall. Zeus has forbidden the gods from waging war on each other. That is why it must be you, Kratos. Only a mortal trained by a god has a chance at defeating Ares. And if I am able to do this, to kill a god, then the visions, they will end? Complete this final task, and the past that consumes you will be forgiven. Have faith, Kratos. The gods do not forget those who come to their aid. Leaving the rotting carcass of the Hydra behind, Kratos set sail once more. His greatest challenge and freedom from his growing madness lay before him in the ancient city of Athens. Come back to bed, Kratos. Ah. Destroy Ares, and the gods will forgive you your past. Joe! Have reinforcements arrived! Ares has brought these beasts to Athens! Without help, the city will fall! The gates destroyed! You'll have to fight another war! <laughs> Kratos, the gods are pleased with your progress, but your current skills will not be enough to defeat the minions of Ares. I offer you the power to freeze your enemies where they stand, but you must earn such a gift. the Gorgons. Bring me her head, Kratos, and I will give you the ability to wield its power. and destroy them all with Medusa's gaze and the power of the Gorgon will be yours. Oh, with 
the gods with us. Go forth in the name of Olympus. Do not fear, Kratos. I am the Oracle of Athens, here to help you defeat Ares. Find my temple to the east, and I will show you how to murder a god. Kratos, you grow stronger as your journey continues. But if you are to succeed in your quest, you will need my aid. I offer you the power of the greatest of all the gods, the father of Olympus. I offer you the power of Zeus. Take this weapon, Kratos. Take this power and use it to defeat your enemies. You have done well, Kratos. Go with the gods. Go forth in the name of Olympus. has chosen wisely. I knew it was so. Who are you? So, you have the blades, the skin as pale as the moon. You are the one indeed. Perhaps Athens will survive at that. <laughs> but be careful. Don't want you dying before I'm done with this grave. A grave? In the middle of a battle? Who will occupy it, old man? You will, my son. Oh, I've got a lot of digging to do indeed. All will be revealed in good time. And when all appears to be lost, Kratos, I will be there to help. Don't disturb me now, son. I've got my work to do, and you have yours. And precious little time left to do either.
Uh, uh, Kratos, I'm slipping. You must get here quickly. I can help you. We can save Athens, but you must hurry. And with that act, Kratos set in motion the events that would lead to his downfall. Kratos, as Athena herself has foretold. But you are late, perhaps too late to save Athens. Or is it Athens you have come to save? No, I, I can't! We must not stop! And when the Oracle Before. looked into his soul, Before. she Before. saw a beast as well as a man. Once a captain in the Spartan army, Kratos had begun his command with only 50 soldiers. But soon his numbers grew to the thousands. His tactics were brutal, but effective. Drunk with power, he was feared by all, except one. His wife was the only one to brave his fury. How much is enough, Kratos? When will it end? When the glory of Sparta is known throughout the world. The glory of Sparta. You did this for yourself. His desire for conquest knew no bounds. But that which he desired would ultimately consume him. By the gods, why would Athena send one such as you? Stay out of my head! Choose your enemies wisely, Kratos. Your brute strength alone will not be enough to destroy Ares. Only one item in the world will allow you to defeat a god. Pandora's box, which lies far beyond the walls of Athens, hidden by the gods across the desert to the east. But be warned, Kratos. Many have gone in search of Pandora's box. None have returned. Go through the gates to the desert, Kratos. There begins the path to Pandora's box. It is the only way you will defeat Ares and save Athens. Kratos, the journey forward is perilous but one you must complete if you are to have any hope of saving Athens. The Oracle spoke of Pandora's box. Can it be real? The box exists. It is the most powerful weapon a mortal can wield. And with such a weapon, I could defeat Ares. With the box, many things become possible. And so it is hidden well, far across the desert of lost souls. There is safe passage through the deadly sands, but only those who hear and follow the Siren's song will discover it. You must find the Sirens, Kratos. Only they can guide you to Kronos, the Titan. A Titan lives? Kronos is the last. Zeus has commanded him to wander the desert endlessly, the Temple of Pandora chained to his back, until the swirling sands rip the very flesh from his bones. Stay true to the song of the Siren Kratos. Your journey begins here. Pray it leads you back to Athens with Pandora's box. Follow the song of the Sirens, Kratos. Find and destroy them all, and the path through the deadly sands will be open to you. The path before you is now revealed.
Kronos, the last of the mighty titans, emerged from the desert sands. On his back, Pandora's temple awaited, massive and patient, ready to challenge all who went in search of its guarded treasure. For three days, Kratos climbed the sheer walls of the mountain. He knew he would either recover Pandora's box or perish inside the cursed temple, never to return to the world of man. So, you think you can conquer the Temple of the Gods, do you? It's never been done, you know. Sooner or later, the Harpies will bring what's left of you back for me to burn. The Gods hid Pandora's box in here, so no mortal would ever claim its power. And yet, year after year, I open the gate for more and more soldiers and place more and more bodies on these pyres. If I were you, I'd leave now. But I can see you are determined. Very well. May the gods grant you strength to conquer the perils that lay before you. Good luck, Spartan. Kratos, the gods demand more of you. You have learned to use the Blades of Chaos well, but they alone will not carry you to the end of your task. I offer you the very blade I used to slay a titan. Take this gift and use it to complete your quest. Take this weapon, Kratos. Take this power and use it to defeat your enemies. Go with the gods, Kratos. Go forth in the name of Olympus.
The wrecked bodies of those who had gone in search of Pandora's box lay before him, and at once Kratos knew who was responsible. For this was not the first time he'd seen the ruined Ares and his minions had left in their wake. Kratos had experienced it firsthand years before. The youngest and boldest captain in the Spartan army, Kratos inspired fierce loyalty in his men. It had always been enough to carry them through any battle until this day. The barbarians to the east numbered in the thousands and descended on the Spartans without mercy. The battle lasted near hours. The discipline and training of the Spartans did little to stem the tide of the merciless barbarians. The soldiers faced a massacre, while their young captain faced the end of his brilliant career and his life. But to Kratos, victory was worth any price, even his soul. Ares! Destroy my enemies, and my life is yours. That desperate call for aid would come to haunt Kratos for all his days. By the gods, what have I become? is impressive, Kratos. But your skills will not carry you to your ultimate goal. I offer you the souls of Hades itself. 
the souls of the dead, who stand ready to fight by your side. Take this weapon, Kratos. Take this power, and use it to defeat your enemies. Go with the gods, Kratos. Go forth in the name of Olympus. Progress is impressive, Kratos. But be warned. Once you ascend to the upper levels of the temple, you will not be able to return without Pandora's box. As Kratos rose through the massive temple constructed to guard Pandora's box, he realized it was a monument not only to the gods of Olympus, but to the madness of the warden who had designed it. He'd conquered the lower floors of Pandora's temple, but what lay in wait above would test even the greatest of all. Kratos had been in service to the gods long enough to know the Harpy had been sent as a warning, a reminder from his former master of the decision that had cost Kratos everything. Had it been that long since he'd almost met his end at the hands of the barbarians? That long since he'd traded everything to save himself? Ares! The sky split apart and the god of war stepped through. Descending from Olympus, he saw the makings of a god in a mere mortal. Ares would save Kratos. He would turn him into the perfect warrior, his servant on Earth. Only a simple pledge of loyalty was required. My life is yours, Ares. From this day, I shall carry forth your will. And his fate was sealed. As promised, Ares rescued his new disciple, bringing forth the power of a god. Destroying those who would slaughter Kratos and his men. As for Kratos, no mere sword and shield would befit the newest servant of the God of War.
The Blades of Chaos, forged in the foulest depths of Hades. Once attached, the chains remained so, chained and seared to the flesh, a part of the bearer's body, a permanent reminder of Kratos' pledge. In return, ultimate power. The rage of Ares exploded from within. But soon, he would learn the true cost of such power. A cost too high even for Kratos to pay. Wretched beast! I know who it is you serve! Return to your master! Tell the God of War I am his no longer. Tell him he is not safe while I walk the earth. I will find Pandora's box. And I will use it to see him tremble and fall before me. Your quest is at an end. You are the first mortal to ever reach Pandora's box. There is still time to save Athens. You must bring the box back to my city and use it to kill Ares. Return to Athens, Kratos. Return and save my city. After a thousand years, Pandora's box was at last freed of its confines. Kratos had found the means to destroy the God of War. Far away in Athens, Ares knew Kratos had succeeded in his quest. So, little Spartan, you've recovered Zeus's precious box. But you will not live long enough to see it opened. I will see to that. Goodbye, Spartan. You will rot in the depths of Hades for all eternity. As the life began to leave Kratos, his thoughts returned to that fateful night. Even in death. The memories, the visions would not fade. 
for how could he forget spilling the blood of his own family? A cruel trick orchestrated by the guard of war. My wife, my child, how they were left in Sparta. You are becoming all I'd hoped you'd be, Kratos. Now, with your wife and child dead, nothing will hold you back. You'll become even stronger. You will become death itself. But as the flames consumed the temple, Kratos realized his true enemy was the god who once saved his life. The same god who had now taken everything from him. Ares! From this night forward, the mark of your terrible deed will be visible to all. The ashes of your wife and child will remain fastened to your skin, never to be removed. And with that curse, all would know him for the beast he had become. His skin white with the ash of his dead family. The ghost of Sparta had been born. In the end, in death, he had failed. As the minions of Ares claimed Pandora's box, Kratos' life faded, and his cursed soul was cast into the fires of Hades. And Kratos fell into the underworld, the river Styx beckoning below, the currents strong enough to carry even the strongest mortal to his eternal resting place. But Kratos had no intention of resting yet. He intended to live, to return to Earth and complete his quest. Let go, fool! You won't drag me down to that cursed river! There is a task left for me above. Ah! I will see it completed. You again? And not a moment too soon. I only finished digging just a moment ago. Who are you? Now that is an interesting question. But for now, you must hurry. Athens needs you. But how did you know I was- Athena isn't the only god keeping watch on you, Spartan. Complete your task, Kratos. And the gods will forgive your sins. Return, but too late. Ares has taken Athens. There is no more hope. No hope. Ares is victorious. We fail. Kratos had traversed the desert of lost souls bested the deadly traps of Pandora's temple, and escaped Hades itself. There was but one task left. Zeus! Do you see now what your son can do? You cast your favor on Athena, but her city lies in ruins before me. And now, even Pandora's box is mine! Would you have me use it against Olympus itself? Kratos, 
Returned even from the underworld. Is this the best you can do, father? You send a broken mortal to defeat me, the god of war? After thousands of years, Pandora's box was finally open. The power of the gods unleashed. Still just a mortal. Every bit as weak as the day you begged me to save your life. I am not the same man you found that day. The monster you've created has returned to kill you. You have no idea what a true monster is, Kratos. undo the deeds of the past. The nightmares that had haunted Kratos for the past ten years had now taken form and substance. His past stood before him. Them again. You cannot save them, Kratos. You gave them up in your quest for ultimate power. There is a price to pay for everything you gain. Not that price. I didn't want them to die. No price is too high for what I offered. And you rejected me. A god! Now, 
you will have no power, no magic. All that is left for you is death. Oh, not, not again. You should have joined me, Kratos. You should have been stronger. By the gods. The battle was not over. The gods, it seemed, had a final gift for Kratos. I still have allies in Olympus, Ares. Now, you will see how strong I am. who saved you in your time of greatest need. I haven't forgotten, Ares. I remember how you saved me. That night... I was trying to make you a great warrior. You succeeded. Kratos had done me impossible. A mortal defeating a god. Ares was no more. The city had been saved and would thrive again. The same could not be said for Kratos, for as he sought to rebuild his soul with the help of the gods, the truth was revealed to him. Athena, rid me of the memories that haunt me still. You have done well, Kratos. Though we mourn the death of our brother, the gods are indebted to you. We promised your sins would be forgiven, and so they are, but we never promised to take away your nightmares. No man, no god could ever forget the terrible deeds you have done. In the end, knowing the visions of his past would never leave him, Kratos made his way to the bluffs overlooking the Aegean Sea. The gods of Olympus have abandoned me. Now there is no hope. And Kratos cast himself from the highest mountain in all of Greece. After ten years of suffering, ten years of endless nightmares, it would finally come to an end. Death would be his escape from madness. The fate of Kratos was not as it seemed. The gods had other plans. Born aloft like a feather, Kratos found himself risen from the sea 
and placed on solid earth. You will not die this day, Kratos. The gods cannot allow one who has performed such service to perish by his own hand. Ares' tactics were brutal. His path of destruction had to be stopped. But now there is an empty throne in Olympus, and a new god of war is needed. Take these stairs, Kratos. They lead to your ultimate reward. And from that point forward, throughout the rest of time, Whenever men rode forth to battle for good cause or for evil, they did so under the watchful eye of the man who had defeated a god. They were driven forward by Kratos, the mortal who had become the new god of war. By defeating Ares, Kratos, the once mortal warrior, became the new god of war. However, Kratos soon found himself alone on Olympus, shunned by his fellow gods. But Kratos had no need for the love of petty gods. He had found a new family in the warriors of Sparta, gaining solace from his past in the carnage to battle. My lord, Kratos! Another city is ready to fall! Soon all shall know the glory of Sparta! Enough, Kratos! With every city you destroy, the wrath of Olympus grows. Soon I will no longer be able to protect you. I need no protection. Do not forget that it was I who made you a god, Ghost of Sparta. Do not turn your back on me. I owe you nothing. Then you leave me no choice. Kratos had turned the pain of his memories into hatred. Hatred for the gods, who had refused to free him from the nightmares of his past deeds. And so he went to Rhodes to deliver the final blow to the besieged city.
suffer! I am the god of war! And shall defy me! Placing all of his godly power into the weapon had rendered Kratos mortal, vulnerable to the arms of death. Bloodied and beaten, he knew that to have any hope of survival, he must retrieve the blade of Olympus. his Spartan army, Kratos dragged himself up from the dirt. to attend to this matter myself. Athena refused to undo her mistake. 
imagine caring for a creature such as yourself? Why? Why would you betray me? It is you who would betray me. Am I to stand idly by while Olympus is threatened? Your hands are already stained by the blood of a god. I will not let Ares' fate be my own. The gods are petty and pathetic, and your rule is weak. I grow tired of this insolence. I am the king of Olympus. And it is my way that is the way of the gods. You must vow to forever serve me. I serve no one. Then you'll leave me no choice. Submit! I would rather die! It did not have to be this way, my son. This path is of your choosing. A choice from the gods is as useless as the gods themselves. Even now, as you draw your last breath, you continue to defy me! Everything you have ever known, Kratos, will now suffer because of your sacrilege. You will never be the ruler of Olympus. The cycle ends here. As the life drained out of Kratos, the arms of Hades reached out to claim their prize. But there was more resting on Kratos' shoulders than he could know. Kratos was destined to bring about change so severe that it would shake the very pillars of Mount Olympus. His death was something that I could not allow. Ares! Destroy my enemies, and my life is yours! This is not the end. Who are you? I am the Titan Gaia, ever-present mother of Earth. I have watched you become a powerful warrior. And I have been with you through all the events of your life. But I can no longer simply watch. We will help you defeat Zeus. Death is an escape, Kratos. You are a warrior of Sparta, not a coward. Only a coward accepts death. I am no coward. Then you must fight. I will show you the way to the Sisters of Fate. Only with their power will you defeat Zeus.
I knew you could not be killed. I never lost faith. Return to Sparta and prepare for battle. But our brothers are dead. You can still hold the sword. Spartans do not surrender. Do as your god commands. And what of you, my lord? I am going after Zeus. It seems I still have allies in Olympus. to find the Sisters of Fate and travel back through time to the moment Zeus betrayed you, for only then will he truly be vulnerable. Kratos, to succeed, you will need more help than I can give. My Titan brother slumbers deep inside his mountain prison. Go, it is time he was awakened. you in this torment. Zeus, my only crime was helping mankind. When I took the fires of Olympus to the mortals, Zeus considered it a betrayal. As punishment, he made me mortal and condemned me to be savagely consumed every day by this Cursed bird! And then, with the fall of night, I am healed. How long have I been here? How long have I suffered this curse? I truly do not know. Thank <laughs> you. 
Please, ghost of Sparta, release me from my torment! Prometheus from the torment of the gods. His flesh has tainted the fires of Olympus and embodied it with the power of the Titans. These ashes will give you great strength, Kratos. Take them within you and use this strength to defeat your enemies. You must find a way across to the island of Kratos, for there lies your path to the Sisters of Fate. Why do you aid me, Gaia? Zeus must be stopped, Kratos. The story of revenge has been told before. You know of the mighty titan Kronos. So fearful was Kronos of the Oracle's prediction that his own children would rise against him, that he decided to imprison them all in his belly. Rhea stood by and watched as her children were devoured one by one. But when the time came for the last of her children to be eaten, 
she was unable to bear another such loss and devised a trick to save the baby Zeus. Rhea commanded the eagle to secret her son away. He was taken to an island far beyond the watchful eyes of Kronos. his desire to free his brothers and sisters from Kronos. But my foolish act of compassion would haunt the Titans forever. For in sparing Zeus, we allowed him to return to us with vengeance in his heart. He betrayed all of the Titans for the sins of just one. The sins of his father, Kronos. The steeds of time, a gift from the great titan Kronos, his unsuccessful attempt to gain the favor of the sisters of fate, and change the destiny which the oracle foretold. of Sparta, then what they say is true. Theseus, of all the fools who try, you would be the last I would expect to seek an audience with the Sisters of Fate. And you are the last one I would expect to become a servant of the Fates. I serve and protect the Sisters of Fate for the glory of Zeus. The time of Zeus is coming to an end. Hmm. You seek the sisters to kill Zeus. <laughs> you no longer possess the powers of a god, Kratos. I doubt you're capable of killing me, <laughs> let alone the king of Olympus. Let me pass, and I will let you live, old man. I do not think that is your choice to make. Come forward. Let us finally see who is the greatest warrior in all of Greece.
destiny has brought us together, warrior. Before my fall in the great war with the gods, I hid away the last remnants of my magic. For the good of the titans, I, Thomas, now bestow what is left upon you. The relic that you hold, an amulet of the Sisters of Fate, will allow you to move swiftly through time while all around you slows. Fallen God, none defy what the fates decree. That is how it must be. Only death awaits you at the end of your journey. My death is what began this journey. The fates have not deemed victory for you. Your soul will never find peace for what you have become. I am what the gods have made me!
Hidden deep within the spire lie the sisters. They control the threads of fate. Gain control of your thread, and you will be able to return to the moment when Zeus betrayed you. Again? Took him. All our men are dead. Jason has the fleece. You must save him. The fleece is the key to Medusa's temple.
was my only escape. I have faced test after test in search of the sisters. And now you have dashed it all away. You certainly do not live up to your reputation, ghost of Sparta. But perhaps this is a test. Are you watching me now, sisters? Give me a sign! Am I the great Perseus to kill this fallen god to receive an audience with you? Will that allow me to bring my love back from the grasp of Hades himself? If not, at least I can bathe in the glory of being the one who brought down the mighty Kratos, the Slayer of Gods. Although I hardly think a harpy's fool such as yourself deserves such praise. Never make it across. You think you can, but you cannot. Do you hear me? It's my wings that will make it across. It is my test! Do you not know who I am? Have you not heard of Icarus? It is my fate to make it across! This is my test! The sisters will grant me an audience, not you. You will die, White Warrior. You will die. I will reach the sisters of fate, and I will use your wings to do so. The sisters will not allow you, a fallen god, to bathe in their light!
sisters have sent you to help me. I realize now. The Sisters' Temple is far above Kratos. You must get back to the surface. Uh, who breaks my chains of torment? You are strong, but you are far too small, even for an Olympian, to be a god. Uh, Kratos. You dare show your face to me after what you have done? I will make you suffer, Kratos. Why would I ever trust a servant of Zeus? <laughs> Kratos, still the arrogant and foolish warrior. You have not changed. Hmm. And how do you plan to defeat the king of the gods? By taking the blade of Olympus back and driving it into Zeus's heart. It holds the power I once wielded as the god of war. The blade of Olympus. I have not heard that name in many years. Since... since the end of the Great War, bloodlust and power raged within Zeus. His desire to rule over mortals was intolerable to us. The war between the Titans and the Olympians forged the landscape of the mortal world. It was a war that we knew the Titans must win. If we lost, it would mean an end to the golden age of the Titan rule. Peace and prosperity for mankind would be no more. The battle continued despite my capture. Then Zeus created a powerful weapon to end the Great War. A weapon forged from the heavens and the earth. The Blade of Olympus. 
I banish you to the darkest pits of Tartarus! in the torment of the underworld, banished to the darkest pits of Hades. I would have destroyed Zeus if you had not put me here, slave of the gods. I no longer do the bidding of the gods, Atlas. I have stomached their betrayal for the last time. Show me the way to the sisters, and I will kill Zeus once and for all. the temple of the Sisters of Fate! None. Not even a Titan know how to reach the Sisters' temple. But it is said he who finds it will wield great power. I have given you the last of my magic, Spartan, and I will help you across the great chasm. But that is all I can offer. the words read it hear me sisters who control the threads keep going Ugh. read it hear me sisters who control the threads keep going Another searches for what only the sisters may give. Read it! As proof that he is worthy. No! Please, no! I cannot do it! Read! Accept this sacrifice of my blood.
Well done, warrior. With this sacrifice, you have proven your resolve to seek out the sisters of fate. However, this is but a small step in your quest to gain an audience with us. You know not what you do. There are things far more important than your revenge. Zeus did what he must to protect Olympus. Gaia speaks nothing but half-truths and falsehoods. The Titans are not to be trusted. In you, Zeus feared the destruction of all he stands for. you reach the sisters. Read the words. Hear me, noble sisters, who forge our destinies. Another seeks an audience to change their fate. Read! As proof that he is worthy. No, Kratos! This will be the end of us all! You must stop! This is your purpose! Die with honor! I give my blood to illuminate the way. Like the fiery phoenix who is resurrected from his ashes, you too search for a second chance at life. Find these ashes and free the phoenix. Only then will you find the path to the temple of the face. of the phoenix. Only fire will set him free.
I have come too far to fail. Sparta! Why do you leave Sparta unprotected? Sparta... is no more. What treachery is this? Zeus... He came under the cloak of darkness into Sparta. for their god to save them. But you did not come. With no choice. I had to seek out the sisters to change the fate of our beloved Sparta, for I am all that is left. <coughs> lost, Kratos. You must go on. There is much at stake here. I cannot defeat the gods. Victory favors you, Kratos. But you must grab hold of your destiny and command it. There is a war on the horizon and we need you to lead us into battle. To what end? The death of Zeus. If you relent, Zeus will torment you still. He will not rest knowing you live. And when you die, his brother Hades will see that your soul is tortured for all eternity. You will have no rest until you destroy him. Take within you this fire that burned your beloved Sparta. Let it 
Fuel your rage and hasten your steps towards destiny. The time to act is upon us, Kratos. This battle is just the beginning of a great war that is to come. of the Titans drive your blades.
been expecting you. Out of my way. Your resolve is admirable. Even if it is misguided. None can change their destiny, Kratos. We sisters determine the fate of all. It was I who deemed that the Titans lose the Great War. And I who have allowed you to come this far. It is not your destiny to kill Zeus. You no longer control my destiny. I see Gaia has filled you with her lies. I have warned you. Let me pass. <laughs> you have always amused us, Kratos. But know this, mortal. There is no power greater than the Sisters of Fate. If you challenge us, you will your future. This is the power of the fates!
you traitors. This power was never meant for a mortal like you! Plotto weaves the thread of life for every mortal god and titan. Find your thread, and you will be able to control the mirrors of the Fates, the source of their power, and use them as a gateway to return to the time when Zeus betrayed you. The power of the fates resides within these great mirrors. Find your thread, and you will be able to control the mirrors, and use them as a gateway to return to the time when Zeus betrayed you. you draw your last breath, you continue to defy me? No matter. What? 
How can this be? The sisters of fate have aided you. Unexpected. The sisters are dead. Hmm. I underestimated you. A mistake I do not intend to repeat. I will defend Olympus! 
Know this, my son. You have started a war you cannot possibly win. The fates have already deemed me victorious. No, Kratos! Stop! Athena! No! Why do you sacrifice yourself? To save Olympus. I do not seek to destroy Olympus. Only Zeus. Zeus is Olympus. <laughs> he brought this to himself. Because of fear, Kratos. A fear felt by his father, Kronos. A fear that wrought the Great War. A fear that drove Zeus to kill you. His own son. His son? Just as Zeus was compelled to destroy his father, Kronos. You are compelled to do the same. No son should destroy his own father. No. I have no father. God after God will deny you, Kratos. They will protect Zeus. Zeus must live so that Olympus will prevail. If all on Olympus will deny me my vengeance, then all on Olympus will die. I have lived in the shadow of the gods for long enough. The time of the gods has come to an end. Remember, Kratos, you have the power to control time itself. been expecting you, ghost of Sparta. The gods are far too powerful for us to defeat now. All on Olympus tremble at my name. Zeus is weak. Ares and Athena are dead, and I wield the blade. We can win the great war, but not in this time. Together, we will destroy the petty gods, and we will see Olympus crumble before us. Come with me, Gaia. Return to my time. Victory awaits. We have faced far worse than this one fallen mortal. But we are the gods. We whom the mortals worship. We who rule over this land. We who will not be swept aside by this petulant fool. Brothers, put aside the petty grievances that have splintered us for so long. We will unite, we will stand together, and I will wipe out this plague! Olympus will prevail!
the destruction of Olympus! Before the Age of the Twilight set upon the gods, a legend rose to claim his place among them. And even though Kratos sat on the throne as the new god of war, he was haunted by visions of his family. A family he himself murdered. But the hands of death could not defeat him. The sisters of fate could not control him. And on this day, the man, the legend, Kratos will have his revenge. My vengeance ends now. My brothers, we were forged in victory. A victory that ended the Great War and brought forth the reign of Mount Olympus. Born from the depths of the underworld, Rooted in the river of souls, our mountain emerged out of the chaos. As it grew, so too did the might of the Olympians. He created a world of peace, a world of prosperity, a world that lives in the shadow and safety of my mountain. 
A mountain that has come to be the absolute measure of strength and power. Now, on this day, that power is to be tested. The mortal Kratos seeks to destroy all that I have wrought. Brothers, put aside the petty grievances that have splintered us for so long. We will unite. We will stand together. And I will wipe out this plague. Olympus will prevail! Has returned. I bring the destruction of Olympus! The Titans will fail again!
challenge me, mortal? A god of Olympus? A true warrior does not hide, Poseidon! Leave the sea and face me! You have disrespected the gods for the last time, Kratos! Zeus should have kept you where you belong. No matter how many gods fall, there will always be another to stand against you. They will fall as well. The death of Olympus means the death of us all. Then prepare for your death, Poseidon.
What will you do, father? You can no longer hide behind the skirts of Athena. Athena is dead because of the rage that consumes you, Kratos. What more will you destroy? The hands of death could not defeat me. The sisters of fate could not hold me. And you will not see the end of this day. I will have my revenge! Petulant child! I will tolerate your insolence no more! Sacrifice. I have been denied release. I, I will defeat Olympus. I will have my revenge. of Hades have never held me! Death cannot hold those with purpose, Kratos. Athena? I have missed you, Spartan. I... I don't... My sacrifice to save Zeus has brought me to a higher existence. You still appear to be an Olympian. Appearances can be deceiving, Kratos. So can the children of Olympus. Perhaps. But remember, my death came by your blade. My blade was meant for Zeus. Be quick with your words. As we speak, the war for Olympus rages on, and mankind suffers. Let them suffer. The death of Zeus is all that matters. 
Zeus will not fall as easily as Ares. To destroy the king of the gods, you must seek the source of his strength. The flame of Olympus. You once sacrificed yourself to save Zeus, and now you seek to destroy him? What has brought about this change? I see truths where I did not before. Perhaps these will earn back your trust. These are the Blades of Exile. They will help guide you on your journey to the flame. Remember, as long as Zeus reigns, there is no hope for mankind. Destroy the flame, Kratos, and the very foundations of Olympus will crumble. Enough, Spartan. Hades, he sentenced me to this eternal torture. My prison of Tinder. But now that you are here, you can free me. All I have left is my bow. Please, free me. And it is yours. Oh, thank the gods. What are you doing? The bow of Apollo, its fiery arrows will clear your path. By the gods of Olympus and order of Zeus, we are the three judges. Face your final judgment, mortal. King Eacus has found you wanting. King Radamanthus has found you worthy. It falls to me, King Minos, to make the final decision. Your future is cloaked in shadow. 
The realm of the afterlife is not yet ready for you. Beyond that door waits your destiny. Father? Calliope? Oh. You are not my daughter. No. But I know who you are. You know of me? They said you would come. Name the toys, Kratos. Show yourself, Hades. Another one of your tricks. As usual, Sparta, you are gravely mistaken. Face me, coward! So eager, Kratos. Relax. Soon enough, we will have our time to play. Calm yourself, Smith God. Uh, uh, ghost of Sparta! It is you. Well, well, well. I thought Zeus would have killed you by now. I thought you would have escaped this cavern by now. <laughs> Zeus may have imprisoned me here. But you are the reason I live in torment. I did you no wrong, Hephaestus. I pursue only one Olympian. Well, as long as it's only one Olympian. <laughs> I seek the flame of Olympus. Do you know of it? For what purpose, Spartan? For the purpose I have chosen. Now tell me, do you know of the flame? All true children of Olympus know of it. We've all come to respect its power, but don't be fooled by its enticing glow. Neither God nor man can touch its lethal flame. I only need to find it. <laughs> if you can find your way out of the underworld, I'm sure you can find your way to the flame of Olympus. <laughs> you have been truly helpful, Hephaestus. Kratos? How do you know of me? You are the ghost of Sparta. Everyone knows who you are. Everyone is afraid of you. There are reasons for that. I'm not afraid of you. It is good you're not afraid, child. Fear is a heavy burden. I'm not a child, Kratos. It does not matter what you are. My concerns lay elsewhere. Kratos, please. I need you to free me. The quest for freedom is also a heavy burden. I cannot help you. You have regained the blade of Olympus. Let the rage of Sparta fuel your blade. <laughs>
yourself at home. This time, you won't be leaving.
Kratos! Can it be? Does this mean Lord Hades rules no longer? The god of the underworld is dead. Dead? Ah, Hades deserved to suffer, though I thought his death impossible. Olympians overestimate themselves. <laughs> Interesting. I will keep that in mind, Spartan. <laughs> You need the soul of a god to use the Hyperion Gate, Kratos. And that one has not been used for centuries. I'm sure it's broken, otherwise I would have seen my beautiful... <laughs> uh, you know, Kratos, I wasn't always like this. A monster. I was once the most prized craftsman in all of Olympus. Zeus rewarded me with my marriage to the beautiful Aphrodite. My mother, Hera, bragged of my talent. But the day you killed Ares was the day my world was torn from me. That day, Zeus became the fiend you now know. Worst of all, he took my beloved daughter, Pandora. My reason for living. I spend my time here trying to recreate her. I fail again and again. She still lives, Spartan. I can feel it. You. You, Kratos. You can bring her back to me. Your child is not my concern. But surely you can understand. You were once a father, too. Remember your purpose, Kratos. The twilight is upon us. His death is our only hope. Understand this, Athena. Zeus will die.
means to an end, Gaia. Nothing more. But I must face Zeus. The Titans must take down Olympus. No! This is my war, not yours. can find the flame of Olympus. Flame? You will never defeat Zeus, Spartan. You will forfeit your life in trying. Of all the lives you should worry about, Helios, mine is not one of them. Feel the power of the sun!
boy Zeus. You must step into the flame to receive its power. You lie, Helios! Hephaestus told me the flame kills all who touch it. And you believe him? That freak has fallen from the graces of Olympus! That is exactly why I believe him. My death will not lead you to Zeus. That is where you are wrong. <laughs> was savagely earned. Its gaze will light your way. Only one who can. I know it. I trust you. You shouldn't. the ghost of Sparta, the fallen god, the cursed mortal. To catch a fly from the ass of Zeus is not worth my time, Hermes. A coward's words, Kratos. You don't try to catch me because you know you can't. Kratos, where are you off to today? <laughs> 
kill any family members lately? Oh, that's right. You're off to kill your father, Zeus. <laughs> Won't happen. Can't happen. Kratos is on a fool's errand. Again. Never, never learn. Never, never change. Kratos the fool who killed his own blood. Kratos the fool among mortals and gods. Forever, ever cursed. Forever, ever doomed. Consumed by vengeance to his last breath. The Spartan lights the way to dusty death. <laughs> What is the meaning of this? Your eyes do not deceive you, Kratos. It is the same box you opened years ago. The power to kill a god still rests inside. I released those powers when I killed Ares. No. Trapped inside that box, there is a stronger power. It has been missing from the world. It all began when Zeus triumphed over the Titans in the Great War. Zeus understood that the evils born from that battle, if left free, would destroy the world of man and gods. To contain these evils, Zeus commissioned Hephaestus to build a vessel strong enough to hold them. Fear. Greed. Hate. He locked them all away in the box in hopes that they would never again infect his reign. When you opened the box to kill Ares, you drew from the forbidden powers. After witnessing your victory, fear gripped Zeus. But the flame is deadly. How can I recover the box? With its namesake, Kratos. Pandora? She is the key to destroying the flame. The key to our revenge. This will be difficult, Spartan. A simple child will not trouble me, Athena. I hope you are right, Ghost of Sparta. You 
may have brute force, but you lack speed. <laughs> You've been lucky in battle, Spartan, but your luck ends today! What makes you think you ever can? You are beautiful, Spartan. by a mortal. Spartans fought with honor, and yet you seek to kill me when I have no way to defend myself? Not fair. But you have your own sense of honor. Right, Kratos? And what has that honor brought you? Nothing but nightmares of your failure. Today you may defeat me, but in the end, Kratos, in the end, you'll betray only yourself. of Hermes. Use their speed to your advantage.
Bravo! Bravo! Our hero has arrived. Applause for another bastard child of Zeus. Just in time for the final act. Hera. You look terrible, dear. Still wanting to kill my husband, I suppose? You know I seek revenge on Zeus. Can't say that I blame you. Since you killed my son Ares, fear of you consumes him. His fears will not matter when he is dead. I'll bring to that. Hera, I seek the child Pandora. Pandora? That wretched little thing my son Hephaestus created? Well, we can't have you do that, my dear. Destroy him. Hello, brother. This is not between us, Hercules. Isn't it? You were always Zeus's favorite. The air on Olympus affects your thinking, brother. Zeus has no favorites. Think about it, brother. While I was stuck cleaning the Augean stables, he chose you to destroy Ares. I'm not convinced. How about this? While you were being crowned the god of war, I was sent to find an apple. <laughs> they called them labors. Ha! Perhaps he did allow me to kill the Nemean lion, but he made your name known amongst the people. A fierce warrior, a killer made a hero, a man made a god. But this time, brother, this time I will destroy you. Call it my thirteenth and final labor. Soon I will become the god of war and claim the throne for myself. You aspire to be an Olympian, yet their reign is in days. We'll see about that.
need your help. Lord Kratos, no! Please! Please, leave me be! I beg of you! Show mercy! Hold your tongue! I knew you'd come back. Tell me where you are. I hear something. He's close. Just tell me how to find you. The labyrinth! Find the labyrinth! Ah! Help! Help, Kratos! Pandora! Pandora, what's happened? Where are you? My son. You trifle with matters you cannot possibly understand. Stay away from this... this... thing. Zeus! Zeus! gone. Kratos, it's been far too long. Even though you are no longer the god of war, you can still share my bed. I have no time for games, Aphrodite. Do you know how long it's been since a real man has come into my chambers? Those bridges outside are nearly destroyed. Zeus refuses to have that stupid mortal Daedalus stop working on his precious labyrinth to fix them. Ah, is that what has you all worked up? You are trying to figure out that bridge contraption out there. You men in your toys. The only one who could fix those bridges is my husband, and we both know he's worthless. Now, I ask you again, Kratos. Will you stay? Ah! Oh. Blessed you, Kratos. You men in your need for war and vengeance. Talk to my husband if you must. You can get to him through there.
Aphrodite. I knew you would return to me. Kratos. Tell me, has Aphrodite conquered another god of war? That is a question you should ask your wife. I seek the labyrinth. I thought you sought only the flame. What could you possibly want in... No! Stay away from her! Stay away from Pandora, Kratos! You are the reason she is in the labyrinth! The reason I live here in hell! I have done you no wrong, Hephaestus. Oh, but you have, Spartan. You opened the box. I did what had to be done. Clearly, you don't understand. The evils of the Great War cannot easily be contained. I forged the box in a power greater than the gods themselves. The flame of Olympus. As the raw metal took shape, I realized the flame was the safest place to protect it. The lock was set. All that was needed was a key, a way to retrieve the box. Created from the very heart of the flame, the key took on a life of its own. Pandora. A child. Neither living nor dead. I grew to love her, Spartan. And she grew to love me as her father. When Zeus came to take the box, I hid Pandora away. I told him that storing the box on the back of Kronos would be the safest place. After all, who could best the Titan? I lied. I did it to save my child. Surely you can understand that. It was your triumph using the box that revealed my deceit. Zeus tortured me until I confessed the truth of my beloved Pandora. He took her away, leaving me alone in my torment. Uh, don't you understand? If you take her to the flame... Understand this, Smith God. I will stop at nothing to destroy Zeus. But if you... You're right, Spartan. If it means the death of Zeus, I'd be happy to help you. Perhaps. Yes, yes, of course. We'll need the Omphalus Stone. With it, I'll make you a weapon. I have weapons. Ah, but not like this. This weapon will give you the retribution you so rightly deserve. The stone rests in the pit of Tartarus. Bring it to me and I will help you. Me to the pits of Tartarus. 
I was tasked by the gods to kill Ares. You killed Ares out of your need for vengeance. But this time, retribution finally comes to me, Sparta. Kratos, your death will not be a gentle one. Why 
do you flee, Kratos? There is no escape. I know that you are here somewhere.
Kratos! You sent me to my death! No, 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 calm yourself, Kratos. I knew you were up to the challenge. I truly needed the Omphalo Stone, you'll see. Make it quick, old man. <laughs> A weapon such as this can't be rushed. Mm. This will be worth the wait. A fine weapon like no other. As I promised. I told him to kill you. I told him the day you were born to kill you. But he would not have it. My stupid husband took pity. And now look what you have wrought. Look at this. Look at it. They're dying because of you. Everything is dying because of you. The sun is gone. The ocean swallowed the land. Disease infects what remains. I am doing all I can to keep them alive. But you... Your ruthless murdering of the gods has caused all of this! Ah! You think this garden is not protected? Your brute strength may have bested Hercules. But your simple mind will never find a way out. I look forward to watching you die here as an old man. challenge us. You think you can just walk away? We aren't finished. <laughs> but 
have you done? What have you done to me? You coward. You destroy all you touch. <laughs> Good luck with that little whore you call Pandora. Next, next, I will, I will take the gift of warriors. I stole That will give me the power, the, the power to bring my son back to me. Soon, soon I will have my boy with me. I built it. My calculations are complete. They are accurate. There is no question of my loyalty.
found the Boreas Ice Storm. It is the key to unlocking the labyrinth. Who's there? My son! My beautiful Icarus! Ah. Good, good. You have the Ice Storm. The Scorpion must be defeated. The Ice Storm! That is the secret of the Labyrinth. To escape it, we must assemble it! Oh, good, good. You, you've already started. I've seen the cubes moving into place. Now, once inside, you must use the gift of Boreas. It is the catalyst that drives the labyrinth. But you're not... But... You're... But you... What have... What have you done with my child? My boy! Where is my boy? Your son is dead, Daedalus. My boy. My... My child. No. No! No! I took the gift of Hades, the liquid fire, and the ice storm to create the power of the labyrinth. Create the power! Create the power! The power to create. The power to destroy. The king of the gods has forsaken me. He said that if I built the labyrinth, I would see the return of my son. He said... He, he said that if I took the liquid fire... Oh, my boy. Oh, my child.
Thank you, Kratos. Our journey is far from over, Pandora. By its end, you will not be thanking me. I know I look it, but I'm not a child, Kratos. I've seen many terrible things. I'm not afraid. I understand what lies ahead. I saw Zeus torture my father. I saw him beaten because of me. I should have helped him, but I was afraid. Hephaestus did what every father should do. Protect his child. No! It's all my fault. I failed him because of fear. Fear is its own kind of darkness. In that darkness, I heard what the gods said about me. They called me a monster. Words mean nothing. Perhaps. But in their words, I heard fear. The fear of an ash-covered warrior. The fear of you. As the fear in the gods rose, mine was replaced by hope. Hope is for the weak, Pandora. Hope is what makes us strong. It is why we are here. It is what we fight with when all else is lost. This is what hope delivers, child. You should learn that now. Chain, Kratos. My father once told me it maintains the balance of power within Olympus. Break the chain to raise the labyrinth. Wait here.
It's all right, Kratos. Remember your purpose, Spartan. Remember why you have come so far. Prepare yourself, Spartan. You know what you must do. I will raise the labyrinth. I will take her where she belongs. Hurry, Kratos! <laughs> There it is. I can see it, Kratos. In the darkness, the fires of hope will set us free. Pandora, no! You know why I'm here. You brought me here to do this. I oh. will find another way. No, Kratos. There is no other way. Let me go! No, child! I am not a child! You're hurting me! <sighs> Down, Zeus! Your obsession with this, this thing has become somewhat of a nuisance, my son. Release the girl, Zeus! Don't confuse this object, this construction of Hephaestus, with your own flesh and blood. But perhaps you already have, Spartan. Your quest for Pandora. Your pathetic attempt for atonement from the family you slaughtered has caused nothing but havoc on Olympus. Look around at what you have done. I see only what I have come to destroy. Taking pity on you has been my greatest mistake, Kratos. Just as taking pity on this thing will prove to be your greatest mistake. This has nothing to do with her! It has everything to do with her! Put her down! As you wish.
traitors. Do not let her into the flame. This is what I am meant to do. You know that. Please. Hush. Kratos, you know this is the only way. Don't listen to her, Kratos. For once in your pathetic life, don't fail. Don't fail her like you failed your family. After all you have sacrificed, it ends in another stunning failure! <laughs> to do after I kill you. Face me, father. It is time to end this. Yes, my son. It is time. You should have chosen the other one. Enough! Father and son will die together! Oh! <laughs> 
close, Calliope. Mother, I'm scared. Are they coming to get us? Your father will protect us. Burn this village! Burn it to the ground! Daddy? Kratos! No! <laughs> See the light. It is changing you. It is time to lay your fears to rest. The light reveals the truth. The power of forgiveness comes from within. To be forgiven, you must find the power to forgive yourself. Fear drove Zeus to kill his father, Kronos. The same fear that brought the great war. A fear that drove Zeus to kill you, his own son. Zeus uses fear to keep you in the dark. Confront your demons and lay them to rest. Today you may defeat me. 
what makes us strong. It is why we are here. It is what we fight with when all else is lost. from the bondage of Olympus and cleansed in chaos, mankind is now ready to hear my message. Look around you, Athena. The world stands in ruin. 
What good is your message? Go if you must. But first, I insist you give me the power from inside the box. The box was empty. That can't be true. I can see it in your eyes. You used my power to kill Zeus. You still have it as we speak. Don't you understand? When Zeus gathered all the evils and placed them in the box, I dreaded what would happen if it was opened again. And so, I summoned the most powerful weapon in the world, and I placed it in the box. I told you, it was empty. Pandora was sacrificed in vain. She died because of my need for vengeance. You must be mistaken. You used my power to kill Zeus. I saw you do it. Unless... Of course. When you open the box, you release the evils to the gods. Infected them. Changed them. Zeus himself fell prey to the dark evils. This is why he became so enraged and obsessed with your death. He was consumed by the evil, fear. I thought the power I placed in the box was never released. All these years, I assumed you drew from the evils inside to destroy Ares. But I was wrong. The power you took from the box is mine. From it, you gained the strength that Zeus could never destroy. A strength great enough to overcome fear. Locked deep inside of you, Kratos. Is hope. It has remained buried, trapped by your guilt and the failures of your past. When you killed Zeus, you must have allowed something to awaken it. What was it, Kratos? Hope is what makes us strong. It is why we are here. It is what we fight with when all else is lost. What was it, Kratos? All I remember is what I have lost. That is why you should give me the power. I understand its true meaning and where it belongs. I trust you to do the right thing, Kratos. You shouldn't. You owe me this, Kratos. I owe you nothing. I made you a god. I sheltered you from the wrath of Olympus. I delivered your revenge on Zeus. It is over, Athena. You would dare strike me down? Again? My vengeance ends now. How could you? Disappoint me, Spartan.